Today is Apple Island Day. We got a big group going to Apple. We go about every 10 days or so. And uh, yeah, we got like 27 people today. So it's gonna be a long trip. But I got, I think I brought five dive masters so I don't have to do all the work. <laughs> so Elvis and the dive masters and the boat crew have about 70 tanks to load right now. So get to work. It's not even seven yet, but we're getting everything, uh, everything put together to get out on the boat. And then people start arriving soon. But they got a lot of tanks to fill or to put on the boat. Too big. <laughs> Everything, all the tanks are loaded. Yeah, ready. All right. There's a lot of, a lot of stuff to organize. Chad. I think we're, I think we're getting there. Yeah, we are. <laughs> we're definitely getting there. We got. Oh, my spare regulators. If you. If, see those regulators we could put them in a box because those are all spares i want to bring it lots going on there's like a massive amount of uh uh planning for these things because today all our divers are brand new open water divers that don't have gear so they have to show up early and fit test all their gear because it doesn't all uh fit and then we have to adjust them. Yeah. You ready? Ready for Aqua, bud? Yeah, dude. Let's do it, man. Have I've you been, have you been before? Too long. No, this is first time. First time. I've been staring at it, going, "Hey, we're <laughs> going over there. Let's do it." All right. I gotta be the last man. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Critter Republic. We have Justin here. You go, go ahead. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Critter Republic. We are gonna be going on an Oppo trip today on March 20th, 2024. We have all these beautiful people ready to see beautiful Oppo Island. <laughs> oh, that was, turtles? That was really good. Nice. Somebody, somebody guaranteed turtles. <laughs> uh, David, David, and uh, Rob. number one and I can say it was amazing what do you got to say it was great dives at Apo. Now we're back at the shop. Let's see what trouble Judea's been getting into all day. Hey guys, just finished the Apo trip. Super fun and amazing, but now Justin's making me clean everything. Yeah. <laughs> all this. Yep. You gotta clean by yourself. But you know what? I'm happy oh, to do it. You know why? Because Justin is honestly such a great boss and like you know, like every day at work is just like such an experience. I love being here. I pay her to lie like that. I remember when Elvis was that enthusiastic for like three days. <laughs> three days at the beginning. How much trouble did you get in today? How many? What happened? It's like Louis like pooping so much. Louis pooped? I do have customers but pooped a lot. Where's Louis? Sleeping. Sleeping and pooping, that's that's, that's like me. Now the least favorite part of every dive. Unloading the boat, cleaning the gear. <laughs> These guys are in their money though. <laughs> this 
so much stuff with 30 divers or 20 something. Hey, Okoya. The visibility was really horrible today. Wavy, not nice. Worst time of year. I don't like this time of year for diving, but all our divers were from California and Oregon and stuff. And they're like, this was amazing. So I guess it's amazing for the, you know, Pacific Northwest diving. I thought it was freezing and miserable, couldn't see anything, and they loved it. Thought it was awesome. So next month is critter season, starting in April. They're gonna have a freaking heart attack. They got about 80 tanks to fill. Night trucks and air. <laughs> Still got some. That's a load. This truck's awesome. We got three divers and two dive masters and they fit comfortably, except Tito. Tito right in the back. <laughs> Tito the critter spotter. All right, it's the next day. We got a few other uh, divers going. They're doing five, well, at least four dives today. And right now they're going to Massaflod. Oh, my, my new tank's just driving. All right. And I don't know where the second dive is. Me and Elvis are gonna go film my new side mount gear, so. Let's do that. Louis, come on. Come on. Let's go see Brett. I forgot one of our dive master trainees is doing his final swim test today. It's not an easy one. It's uh, 800 meters with fins in 17 minutes. 17 minutes. And then 400 meters in 12 minutes. How many? 10 minutes without, without fins. Yeah, oh, 400 meters in 10 minutes without fins. And then a 100 meter swim test, and I think that's like two minutes or something. Good luck, Brett. It, it tried to kill me when I did it. I think I made a video about it. Yeah. Oh, Brett's one of those guys. He's been, uh, you know, he's never gonna work as a dive master. He's retired, just loving life, but he wants the skills of one. You know what I mean? He wants to go diving all the time with him, his friends, his girl, whoever. Just wants the skills of a dive master. And uh, he could also buy sanctuary tickets and stuff like that as a dive master. But anyway, he's been working hard. Uh, and yeah, props to you, Brett. All right, he's starting the 800, I think. I think he has fins on. Yeah? See you next week! <laughs> All right, what do you got here? So we got some new, uh... actually, let's go show my new gear on here. So I'm working in, with a company called Yushin, and uh, so I can be a distributor for their side mount and regulators, side mount regulators, and so me and Elvis are working on, uh, well, I wasn't gonna say this, but we're starting a new channel. It's almost ready. We got a whole bunch of videos ready. This is for my divers only, and I'll promote it later when it's actually ready. I don't wanna tell you what it is yet, uh, but it's gonna be for divers only. That way I can do the, take away the technical, uh, like tips and tricks and how to dive from this channel and just do like the vlog uh, resort or dive center life on this channel and do the really hardcore stuff like how to set up a harness or uh, right now we're doing how to configure your side mount regulators and unboxing reviews, dive computer. So yeah, that new channel is gonna be totally different. So that's what we're doing right now. We're about to film a regulator video. So I'm messing up the little uh, studio, but Check out these sweet first stages. It's gonna be awesome on my personal side mount rig. And then I'm, we'll be selling them in the shop as well. I got a real small, low profile one. Love this thing. So we're fixing to put it all together for like a little tutorial. Uh, actually, the other channel is not just tutorials, it's uh, 
we're gonna be following my side mount journey. I'm starting from scratch and learning everything. Elvis is way ahead of me because he already had his side mount gear and had time to do the courses with Mark, but uh, I got a lot of catching up to do, so he's helping me out. And right now we're making videos. We're making videos about making videos, so lots of videos going. So we're filming this uh, side mount regulator setup and Mark just arrived. Brett passed his big swim test, the 800 meter, so yes. Uh, I gotta take a break from filming. <laughs> I need a studio. It's hard to do when people are in and out all day. Just had a whole bunch more divers come in. And now about to start and these divers came back. What happened? Oh, you just came to get tanks? No, uh, we come back here. Uh, we take for so easy. Uh, let's get the uh, battery. Oh, okay. They're going back out. They just needed uh, camera batteries. I thought it was a little early. Cool. Yeah. How, how was the first dive? Nice. We have so many divers there. And a little bit behind us. So, uh, flamboyant. The hairy. Oh, flamboyant? Not also a uh, frogfish. But a hairy frogfish? No, the other one was from Bongo Bongo. We saw the hairy frogfish. Maybe on a second dive, we're fine. So you saw the flamboyant? Yeah. Two. That's good. Cool. Oh, two. The the diver is from Quebec. Really wanted to see a flamboyant. He's seen everything. Not everything, but a lot of stuff except for the flamboyant. And now I guess they just saw two. So he had to get more batteries. That's a good sign. If you need more camera batteries. All right, take three. Let's finish this thing. Uh, we got to hurry before more people come in. And it's the next day. Super busy down here because Mark is teaching another dive master course. And my other instructor called in sick, so I'm teaching uh, two open water courses in the classroom. And Princess is helping me film. Uh, she's doing some like social media for Judea because Elvis is is guiding this diver. Where are you guys going? Right out front. Right out front. Go find some critters. Princess. And Noel and uh, Tuping are diving. They're guiding the group that's been here all week. They're doing like four dives today at least. Uh, and they're, they're, they're in my truck down at Zambagita today. That's, uh, I think it's called Malatapai. That's a, that's a cool dive site and they've been going to every dive site they're super happy because they they just did liveaboards in uh komodo raja and uh lembe and then he said he saw more here in front of my office in week one than he did all those areas he wish he would just came here he's crossed everything off his bucket list and then way more so yeah i'm on a lunch break right now then i gotta get back in the classroom and i'm gonna be in there I'm gonna be teaching this course for the next four days or three days. Uh, busy times. We had a lot of other plans this week. St starting this new channel and doing all these gear reviews and all these other things that we're supposed to do. But now I'm teaching, so it's okay. Good problem to have. Let's go see what Judea's doing. Got it. Yeah. Hello. Lunch break. Okay. <laughs> Are you editing? Oh. Let's see. Oh, you're you not know. editing. Ah. <laughs> Let me see. Are you you wanna see what is this? It's not a nudie Spanish bread. dancer? No. It's a flat worm. Somebody said it's a flat worm, but I'm telling her. So it's go check out Critter Hunter and Critter Republic on Facebook and Instagram. We just finished the physics chapter. Now we're on to the fun stuff. But after lunch. So we got two dive master trainees right now. And 
They're both gonna be with me, assisting me in the pool tomorrow with my two open water students. Uh, right now, the new one is doing some tests. Brett, our other one that's about to be finished, he's assisting me sitting in on the night trucks and uh, other courses. And then tomorrow, both of them will be in the pool with me assisting, working as an assistant, you know? It's good for their skill circuit, but also knowing how to uh, assist an instructor and stuff like that. Because Elvis will be busy tomorrow guiding, being a dive master, because he passed, he, he's an official dive master now, so. Anyways, I'm waiting for lunch to arrive. And the students will be back in an hour. Yeah. Louis. How'd the dive go? It went really amazing. That's good. Yeah. <laughs> All right, we're gonna ask Elvis and them how their dive went right now. Yeah. All right, Elvis, how did the dive go? Of course. It's Great. Good. How was the dive? Fun. Great. <laughs> Did you see anything good? Yeah. These are those. A lot of razor fish. Uh, I also saw about two or three interesting little rats. Cool. How did your dive go? That's good. Did you There's see anything? Frogfish. Frogfish? Yeah. Where did you go diving? Sanctuary? I don't know. Stop La lata. La lata. La lata. La lata. Cool. Sambonguita. <laughs> Frogfish are the kid. Well, how'd the Why? dive go? Huh? How'd the dive go? Uh, very nice. We saw Harley Kane, uh, Brockfish. Yeah. He's lying. Yeah, I'm not lying. Where's the footage? Uh, uh, try, uh, 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 sorry, yeah. Uh, try, uh, yeah, that's true. Try, uh, asking for the guy. Also. Yeah, you saw. Princess is working on a uh, t shirt display. Not the cabinet, but like these. Uh, T-shirt displays we'll put like right there. Yeah. We're selling a lot. Of, uh, let's yeah. see. Yeah. Ooh. We got four colors now. Alright, where do you want to put it? Oh, pretty. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, one more. Green. We got green, blues, and blacks. But we're only going to put two up there. Thanks, Julian. Jules gave me a uh, grenade coffee cup, coffee mug. Because I keep breaking mine. He also <laughs> gave you both of his children. It's not a good trade because he gave me all his children as well. <laughs> Jules and, I mean, Elvis and Princess. <laughs> Thank God his other kid is still in school. So how's that look? Yeah, so you guys can come get shirts if you want. So, anyways, I think that's it for today. Uh, we went to Apple Island. Next day we went to whatever we were doing today. Teaching courses, teaching dive master courses, doing lots of fun dives. And then Elvis had a surprise dive with a guest that showed up late. Uh, so, pretty fun day. Tomorrow's more of the same. I'll have my open water students in the pool doing their first skills with two of the dive master trainees so they could assist and these guys will take the group out to another dive site or whatever anyways that's kind of like a short version of a day in the life at the dive resort so uh if you guys want more of that i think we're gonna have to do more of these uh weird impromptu vlogs that are about nothing so uh let us know See you.